Hello everybody. I uh, wanted to do a quick walk around video of this 2019 BMW M4 uh, that we are going to be selling on drive down. Um, this is one of a few cars that we're selling, you know, definitely excited to be uh, partnering with this exciting platform and being a part of something a little different. Um, so yeah, wanted to just do a quick walk around video, obviously um, did a, you know, detailed write up about the car. So if you, you know, want to see the specs and everything like that, that's below or sorry, actually, I guess this video is at the bottom, so it's above, but, um, just wanted to do a quick walk around and show you the state of the vehicle. So there's a 2019 BMW M4 Coupe. Um, it does have the, in my opinion, completely necessary competition package. The only thing that's a little tricky is it's got the 19 inch wheels that were standard with the non-competition package. So what a lot of people don't know that you actually had the option to do the 19s instead of the 666M 20 inch wheels that came with the competition package. I think these wheels, number one, they look great. Number two, they're not as prone to bending, cracking, or getting bubbles in tires as the 20s. So it's actually a nice option, in my opinion, if you're gonna daily the car. Um, color combination, mineral white over secure orange, which I don't know why they call it secure orange, because it's basically red. Um, mineral white's actually a pretty rare color to see on these. Um, it is a 2019, so it is technically an LCI or facelift. So it's got the facelift um, LED headlights, which I think are really cool. They have a little bit of a different shape. Um, with the competition package, you obviously get the blacked out grills. Um, you'll see in the back, you have black exhaust tips and a black uh, M4 badge. Um, so just walking around the car, um, it's honestly in really, really good shape. Um, nothing really to report dent scratch wise. We did a lot of recon to this car, which you can see in the maintenance uh, detailed. I mean, I know we did uh, oil change, micro filter, air filter, um, spark plugs. And he had just done uh, one owner uh, who bought it originally from us and traded it in actually on another M4 manual, a new one. Um, he had just done front brakes in November. So, you know, cars had a ton of recent maintenance. Um, so like I said, uh, mineral white. Um, the nice thing about this car is it does have paint protection film. So they did a really nice job. So it's got paint protection film on the hood, the headlights, the bumper, the front fenders, the mirrors. I don't know if he did it here. I don't think so. Um, rockers, you see right there. And then also on the back of the bumper right here. So um, honestly, the car's in really good shape as we walk around. Love the M4, you know, came out with this and it kind of has like a CSL style trunk um, from factory. It's kind of got that lip, which is really cool. Walking around, mineral white, such a cool color. It kind of presents as silver in some lighting conditions. Um, IND uh, painted front reflectors, which are nice because I hate orange reflectors that we get in the US. If you're somehow on our site from Europe, you're very lucky. Um, Sunroof, which I know will split opinion. A lot of people like the carbon roof on these. I like the sunroof, um, but I also have the carbon roof. I go either way. Um, it's nice if you want to drive it in the summer and stuff like that. Um, interior is honestly in great shape. This car, uh, an option that it has that I love, which really dresses up the interior, is it's got the full leather. So you've got leather on the door tops. You've got these split door panels here, right? And then the leather dash, which if I just pop the squat in here and take the uh, stickers off, you can see we've got sort of stitching that runs along here and then contrast red stitching that goes along the dash that's honestly stunning. Um, and the whole lower dash is leather too. So you've got this stitching here and down here. Yeah, it definitely just dresses up the interior. It's also got the carbon fiber trim with the black chrome, which extends onto the door, which is just a really cool look. Harman Kardon sound system, Logic 7. So you got the subs under the seats, that's great. Wireless Apple CarPlay, you can see I actually have my phone hooked up to this. So if you just go over here, you can see you've got, you know, the wireless CarPlay on there. Um, car as it sits today, 40,279 miles. Looking at the seats, the competition pack gets the uh, bolsters, or sorry, the seat backs that have the holes in them. They're lightweight sports seats, so a little bit of more of aggressive of a bolster, and they are inflatable with this switch right here. Um, seats in great condition. Honestly, just a tiny bit of wear there. But other than that, looks really good. Back seats look like they've never been sat in, which is pretty typical for these. Even though you can definitely fit people on the back. That's one of the cool things. I don't have the key. Stupid. Just wanted to show you the passenger side real quick. So right here, passenger seats in unbelievable shape. I mean, bolsters literally perfect nothing on it the cool lights in the seats there um yeah i mean that's really all there is to report you know a lot of you know great recent maintenance um which is awesome um car has executive package too so it's got blind spot um it's got a lot of different stuff and you can see again in the um you know in the uh write-up sort of detail what options it has and then 
also PPF here for when you load loading stuff into your trunk. Competition package also gets an exhaust that sounds awesome. Um, we can just look under the hood real quick too. One of my favorite, one of my favorite things, I forgot you have to pull it twice. One of my favorite things about the F82 and F80 and also the M2 Comp gets this carbon strut brace. I mean, it's just a thing of beauty. One that the new M4 doesn't have, so. It's a great motor. Um, these cars I really think are, are greatly underappreciated and a lot of them are, are DCT, so it's kind of rare to find a, a manual one. And I drove it for a little bit and, and it's a lot of fun. It's a great car. So um, that's probably gonna do it uh, with this M4. Um, but yeah, I mean, fresh tires, tons of maintenance. It's ready to be enjoyed. And again, it's a really rare sort of, you know, standout color combination and with the competition pack, which really transforms the car. So if you have any questions, just feel free to comment below, reach out to us. Um, we're happy to help. And uh, hopefully we will find this car a uh, great home. Thank you, everybody. Bye.